As the opposition struggles, Idi Mnangogwa Senu PF is in the lead before the elections. Zimbabwe is getting ready for elections on August 23rd, and it looks like the ruling Zenu PF party is well organized and ready. While the opposition is struggling, Zenu PF has finished choosing candidates through its primaries, and it recently held an orientation program for those who were chosen. Nomination papers are being sent to provincial and district party officers so that changes can be made before the nomination period starts. Political experts say that Zenu PF has a good chance of winning the elections because it has prepared well and because President Emerson Mnangagwa wants to change the country. Citizens Coalition for Change CCC, on the other hand, is having trouble choosing candidates. Nelson Chumisa, the leader of the party, says that he is the only person who can sign nomination forms. He says this is so that there are no duplicates. But this has led to worries about lack of transparency and internal democracy. Some analysts say that the lack of political structures in the CCC could make supporters nervous because they don't know who is running for which seats. Funding also seems to be a problem as CCC candidates are having trouble getting the money they need to pay nomination fees. Because of how unclear the CCC's processes are, only a few urban candidates are likely to run. Mike Bama, the political commissar for ZANU PF, said that successful candidates are sending their nomination papers to provincial and local party officers so that there is time to make changes. On the other hand, analysts say that Nelson Chamisa's dictatorial style and the fact that he hasn't set up grassroots structures within the CCC show a lack of seriousness in plan. As the election day gets closer, ZANU PF seems to have a comfortable lead, thanks to careful planning and good organization. Because of the chaos in the opposition, especially in the CCC, many of the candidates may not run.